Hi, this is Shadi. Today I have a fun one for you. It is a little uh, sparring round with my teacher Frédéric de Montfaucon. For those of you who don't know, he is an Olympic bronze medalist from Sydney and world champion from Munich in 2001. His specialty is Yoko Tomoenage, as you will see very shortly, and Seoenage. And, uh, I developed a great Tomoenage thanks to him and of course uh, I will um, share with you what happened briefly not all of it it's too long uh, just what I was thinking what he did etc but before that please don't forget to check out my book the origins and history of judo a translation of the manuscript of 1903 link will be below so it starts uh, very light and uh, I, I'm very happy with my trampling as it gets the movement going. I, it's, I still have a very weak support foot. But here, look at the trampling, how he gets moving. And I get the sweep, but there's just no supporting foot or hand uh, behind it. I'm still catching timing, but not so much the that hips. So here, I circle him around tried to get the coach Higari, but he saw it coming. He taught us that uh, counter quite a few times. So let's see it again. Here I I cross step and circle him around me, try to catch the foot. I did catch it actually, but he's just too strong and too balanced. And uh, he has a very good uh, posture. Here, for example, uh, his name is Kimura actually. He was retreating and I caught the foot that's why I got a bit lucky uh, in catching uh, this one uh, in Japan. So it's Coach Higaishi. And instead of removing the foot and rotating with the arms, he actually does like as if you're foot sweeping the same movement and rotates uh, with the arm. So I got him going. I got him moving. I caught the foot. But uh, I was just not solid enough. So here i i was like okay let's go for the tomoenage the audacity i had to actually do it so i'm not a stranger to this move as i can see i catch it quite often uh when sparring here again in japan against a much larger man so i'm no stranger to this technique but of course that's like trying to hit in a way with an uchimata it's just impossible but nonetheless you try here again another example I caught it countless times, but again, so here I get a bit defensive and he was twitching and tried to hit with an Uchimata. I do a hip defense and here I do this twitch, pull, go for Yoko. Again, it's pointless. It's This is what I was trying to do. So this is uh, Mark Housinga again. I think if I, the moment I fell in love with Tomoe Nage was, was when I was watching uh, Housinga. So he twitches forward and then goes like this very similar i tried to do it but again uh, the posture was nowhere near broken as this one here so mark had this uh, tomoenage where he caught it from this uh, almost submissive posture but he scored with it countless times and uh, if you know a thing or two you would know that him and uh, frederic fought a lot like mortal enemies on the mat almost and uh here he is fighting uh, de montfaucon and uh he he hits and he he said that he was actually honored that he did it against de montfaucon since he was the best at it and uh it's uh it's quite nice to see it and also me you know trying to hit it and of course it's futile but you know it, it's it's a lot of fun but of course we cannot delay the inevitable there it is and uh let's see it again he rotates beautiful catches with the other leg um my other foot on the side so it prevents the escape so um it's all good it's all you know good energy on the mat and uh again here before the end he gets another one but i almost managed to escape uh not a full score i don't know but 
you know it's mainly it uh, I'm really happy with you know how I get the things moving before I attack I don't just attack randomly like before you know years back etc and uh, he's just so strong his base is solid and I was trying to move him around trying to catch him it's just pointless but you know this is what it is against you know much high level again Olympic medalist and world champion so but I'm very happy he's my teacher and I'm just really honored that I get to meet these people and learn from them so if you have anything to add please let me know down below don't forget to check out the book it will be linked in the comments this was Shady and thank you for listening